Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. In today's video, I am going to talk about four hidden features for Samsung Galaxy Tab S8 Plus. So guys, let's start. So guys, you can create multiple user accounts for your Samsung Galaxy Tab S8 Plus. So what you have to do, just bring down the notification panel and here you see this multiple user icon over here on top okay it is yellow in color let me show you so this is how it looks like okay now for example i just selected okay so here you see it is open the user menu and here you see it is showing you the owner friend guest and you can add more users okay so if you want to switch uh, from owner to friend you just select it and now it is showing you switching to friend okay over here this notification showing now it will change into a completely different setup with different apps and different settings so you can see over here so now it is switched to friends okay and here you can see i have these apps okay and this setup over here now if you want uh, you can give it to your friend you can customize this setting for each user as well okay now for example i want to move back uh, to the owner okay so i again select this uh, user over here and here now i select this owner and now it it will switch back to the owner okay so you can see over here so uh, how to enable this option how to enable multiple users okay so i will open uh, my tablet so first of all what you have to do you have to go into the settings okay so once you enter into the settings you will see on your left side uh, just scroll down and you will see this option of accounts and backup just select it once you select it you will see the second option over here it is showing you the users okay so just select it and once you select it and here it will be very easy for you you can add user okay you can turn this on if it is off just turn it on it is showing you here first of all you as a owner as a administrator okay and then you have different lists you can create more lists you can create uh, for multiple uh, accounts for your family members for your friends so you can create different ad accounts and they can only access that account okay you can lock them you can create different type of settings okay so for example if you select this add user account it will take you to a different screen and here you can give it any name okay so for example i want to give it a name of family okay so i just write here family i press okay and then it start adding new user and then it will ask you for different settings okay so you can see uh, you uh, you can select this switch to family from here so for example i switch to family and here you see it is showing you the setup now option so you can create a new setup for each user the second feature is related to clipping option in samsung notes okay so for example i open the samsung notes i open a new page over here and now i want to add some picture i want to clip some picture from my gallery to my samsung notes so i just uh, open the edge panel uh, then i open my files folder i drag and drop in the split screen okay and here i have different images okay so for example i like this image okay so i just select it so once you select it you just open it like this and once you select it you will see there is a small notification appear it says image attach okay so if you directly select it this will automatically attach this image into your notes okay so whatever image you open okay so for example i open this image and again it is showing me this option over here for attaching this image so i can easily attach okay so how to enable this clipping option in your samsung notes so what you have to do you have to go back to your samsung notes okay and then open the menu and you see the settings icon over here just select it once you select it you have to scroll down in your settings and you see this option of clipping options okay and it says clip web pages pictures chat rooms into notes created while using galaxy internet 
and messages so you have to enable it if it is disable just enable it then you will get the same option of attaching any image from your gallery into your samsung notes the next feature is related to smart select pin option so for example you open any kind of website or any information and you want to use the smart select okay so for example i want to smart select uh, this image over here so i open the smart select okay so i just select this image okay now it is selected okay and now what i will do i will just pin it okay so you can see this pin option over here on top so i just pin it so it will be pinned into my screen and for example i can now access uh, any other thing but this pin, the, the picture the image which is pinned is still available now for example uh, i want to open uh, my gmail i want to send an email to someone and i want to attach this image so it will be very simple now for example i open gmail i open a new mail and now i want to attach this image into my email okay so i just press and hold it okay like this and i can simply drag it over here into my email so you can see now it is attached to my email and then i can easily send it to anyone same way you can use this in your samsung notes the next feature is about mini timer so you can open this clock app which is a pre-installed app in your samsung tab s8 plus so i will open uh, this app and on bottom side you see this option of timer okay so you just select it and here you can set any time for example here you can select different minutes or different hours okay and then different seconds so whatever time you want to select you can select it from here or you can select directly from here for example if you want to set it for 10 minutes for 15 minutes or for 30 minutes so whatever time you select okay you can just select it and then you can press this start okay so i just select the start so the timer will start over here and if you even if you close it okay for example even if i go to my home screen so a small timer will appear over here it's a mini timer you can see it is showing over here you can move it to any position so it will uh, work over here and then you can use your apps okay you can use your different apps the timer will still showing over here so you can see this is the timer it is showing so you can work on your apps or if you uh, set your time for your study so you can use it okay so if you want to take notes okay so you can take your notes the timer will still be available so this is how you can use the mini timer uh, in your samsung tab s8 plus and if you click it again you can maximize it if you want to pause it you can pause it from here you want to resume it you can resume it if you close it then it will available over here you can pause from here as well so this will be really helpful in the productivity system so you can make your lecture notes you can take your uh, study notes uh, you can read a book whatever you want to do you can use this timer as well and if you finish just uh, select this exit okay and it will exit so this is how uh, you can use this mini timer. Uh, so guys, this is for today's video. I hope you liked the video. I hope you enjoyed the video. So please subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much.